Hello everyone, welcome to Daily English Homework. In this video, we are going to listen and analyze Elon Musk's English. Of course, he is a native English speaker. He was born in South Africa. He later moved to Canada, I believe when he was around 17 years old. And now he's uh, working and living in America. So he's been to many English speaking countries. And I think his English is very unique. So we're going to listen to it. Your homework is to watch this video and let me know uh, how well you understand his speaking and what you think of his English. All right, let's get started. Um, so this is an interview about, uh, you know, he is a CEO, CEO of Tesla cars, the electric cars, and he's going to be talking about cars. Now we're not focused on the content, we're just focused on how he speaks, how he expresses himself. So let's go back here. And I'll just play. to predict. He's getting I mean, the thing that really got me, and I think. All right, so let's listen. I think it's going to get a lot of other people is that there, there are just so many false dawns with, with self driving. All right, he, he has a little. He's, I got to warn you, he makes me feel better about my stammering. Okay, so if you watched many of my videos before, you'll notice that I often stammer. And when I, what I mean by stammer is, 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 it's not quite quite a stutter because a stutter is more of a, a, a mental something's happening in the brain that's blocking how you speak. Uh, a, a stammer is more of a habit of just repeating the words, things like that. Uh, so you could argue stammering is bad, but it's what I do and it's what he does. And he's the richest guy in the world, so it's not that bad. So let's listen again. I'll point it out. Um, where you think you think you got you think you think you got all right so he's just repeating himself there the problem have a handle on the problem and then it nope uh, it turns out uh, you, you just hit a ceiling uh, you, you you just hit a ceiling so you, can you hear that ceiling. Um, and and uh, um, and and uh, 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 because what happened what, what, if, well, right. if you were to plot the progress the, the progress looks like a log curve so it's like yeah, a series of log curves. So uh, most people don't know what a log curve is, I suppose. But it, 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 show, show the shape. It, 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 it goes. It goes. It 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 it. it. So uh, let's let's listen to that part again. That was. If you were to plot the progress, the, the progress looks like a log curve. So it's like yeah, a series of log curves. So listen to this part. Uh, most people don't know what a log curve is, I suppose. But okay, here. It, 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 show, it, it, show the shape. It, 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 it goes. It goes. It, 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 it goes. The opposite of it. Not making fun of him. I'm just pointing it out because I also stammer. But that is a unique way to talk. Uh, why do we stammer? I don't know. I guess it just helps us think as we're saying our words. If, you know, sort of a fairly straight way, right. and then it starts tailing off, right. and, 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 and and you start and a kind of ocean getting diminishing them. returns. You know, in retrospect, they seem obvious, but. Uh, in, in order to solve uh, full self-driving, all right, he uses a lot of he uses a lot of those fillers. Uh, uh, and 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 he stammers like me. So this is one person I would say that talks similar to the way I talk. Uh, I stammer a lot. Uh, it's not a bad thing. It's just one way people express themselves. And uh, some of us repeat words. Some of us use a lot of fillers. That's just the way we do it doesn't matter right doesn't matter he is trying to give information in this interview he's speaking english he's fluent in english yes he's not the the most eloquent speaker in the world but doesn't matter he's expressing himself he's giving information to the interviewer so his english yeah he's a native speaker uh do I want my students to stammer like me? Yeah, I, I would prefer my students have clear English with no stammering. Uh, but if they do stammer a little bit, no problem, no problem. Uh, properly, you... I now, for his accent, does he have a South African accent? Does he have a Canadian accent? Does he have an American accent? Now, I would say he does have a sprinkle, a little bit of South African accent. 
I don't think it's too strong, but it is there. Does he have a Canadian accent? I wouldn't say, but you know, he's he's been living in Canada and the U.S. for a long time, and certainly no one really cares about his accent. Nobody makes it's not it's not strong enough that people make fun of it. Actually, just you have to solve real world AI. So his accent's perfect, right? There's no good or bad accent. It's just an accent. Um, you you you, you, know, you said like, what are the road networks designed? To, to work with that is all right you can hear that stamp to 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 and 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 designed to work with a biological neural net our brains um and with uh vision our eyes uh, but how he expresses himself how he talks that's elon musk no one makes fun of it that's just the way he does it and certainly you can feel the intelligence of the man in what in the words he's he uses not how he uses the words, the, the words he uses, all right, if you, that makes sense. You know, you listen to the words, not how he expresses the words, and you'll still realize that uh, he's an intelligent man, and he should not be judged like me on the stammering. Um, and so in order to make it work uh, with computers, you basically need uh, to solve real-world AI uh, and, and vision. Because because we... we because because all right anyway i gotta stop it here uh i he's not the best speaker in the world he's not like obama who's a wonderful speaker and i'll do obama in another video but uh he is a native speaker his accent is perfect the way he speaks is perfect and if if you speak like him no problem no problem at all all right thanks for watching let me know if you can understand him or uh you, you have difficulties understanding him. I'll put a link to this interview in the, uh, the description. You know, I can't show too much of the video because my video will be copyrighted. So you can check it out later. All right. Thanks for watching.